Greetings, fellow hooligans of the internet. Hang on. Let me try this. Okay. Welcome to another episode of War Thunder. Today we are playing the A6M3. I believe it's like the... Yeah, like the third or the second... No, third or fourth Japanese Zero you can get in the game. And literally, this is my first flight in it. I've never flown this plane before. I've flown the other, I've flown a couple other zero, Japanese Zeros in the in War Thunder, but I've never played this particular one. So, let's hope we have a good game. We have a, a we have two 7.7 .7 Type 97 machine guns and one Type, no, two 20mm Type 99 Model 1 cannons. Blech. I cannot do anything. Oh, and of course it's got cla classic zero responses. It responds like a beast to the controls. Now, the one downside I have to the Japanese zero, at least in real life, is there are no self-sealing fuel tanks. Thus, meaning bullet goes through your fuel tank, if it catches fire, you're doomed. And well, completely doomed, but if it hits gas and doesn't catch on fire, you're still doomed, but not as much. You have a higher chance of making it back to base because you, you'll run out of fuel really fast. Meanwhile, if it catches on fire, it'll destroy your wing. Basically everything else about your airplane. I'm still completely ill because this is literally the next day from the B-25 J-20, the, uh, Ground Forces and the C-202 videos. And then the Minecraft video was recorded before all of those, so, yeah. There's a BV-238. That's nice. At least we got a good bomber. There are no fighters over there by that guy, so I'm gonna go straight this way. Towards these guys. Oh look, there's an American A6M20. Oh, all the enemies are over there. Oh wow. P39, P38, P40, Firefly. No, that's a Chinese zero. Never mind, I'm a, I'm an umpty. Holy crud. That's a lot of red. The P-40 just got itself deaded. I think those two guys are going for the... What a brave pilot. He's flying right into the horde. Here he comes. Or there he goes. In fiery ball in fiery balls of glory. And these guys are gonna come right at me. And I'm gonna die. Watch, this guy's gonna stall out and then come grab and come kill me. What's this guy? That's a P38. Don't tell me I just flew underneath their radars. I did. 
those two guys just, just flew. Never mind, that KI-44 is coming back. Come on, Zero. This guy's gonna get outrun me. Die! No! Storm it! <sighs> Chinese KI 44. Well, next game. Okay, let's try this. I've changed the settings a bit, and hopefully you guys should be able to hear my voice with the mic far enough away from me that you are not getting the sounds. Pounds or kilograms? I can't smell. Oh my! What hit me? I'm dead. I'm completely dead. Of course, it was a Russian dork that got me. He died. He's dead. We're all dead. Yay. Okay. Let's do this. Whole shebang. Ah, hang on. Again. Okay then. Let's see. Doesn't look like there's a lot going on right now. Okay then.
Sorry, I've, sorry guys, I've been totally quiet this entire time because my mind has gone completely and utterly blank. Okay then, let's see. Don't, oh, yeah, um... I actually do not know what to talk about. Hmm? What is this guy saying? He's saying, way out in the boonies. What, what is it, boy? Huh? Huh? Sir, where are you? Where are you telling us where to go? You, B B25, why are you saying way out there in the middle of the ocean? What's out there? Sir, are you, are you? Sir, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna ask you to uh, land your aircraft and step out. How, have you had anything to drink today, sir? No, okay, good. Is that sake I smell? Kidding making a bad joke. Screens are My screen is so dirty, I'm having a hard time telling what's dirt and what's an enemy airplane that's just a dot. Here, let's get some altitude. Didn't do much good. Ah! Hello there! B-25, you were correct. There is indeed an enemy aircraft up here. Let's go. Oh, there's a P61. Which means I'm screwed. P61 scary. PE2. Sorry, PE2, but there's about 50 other guys right here. Oh, the BV just got rectified by that P-61. I feel sorry for that P-61. I'm not going to be able to catch this guy. And there's a zero coming right at me. There's something up there too. Look, see it right there? Right there. And up. Get him, ally. Yes. Oh, someone just swore in Russian. I want to go for that bomber there, but my friend's in danger here. Attacking. 
Oh! Oh! Blade, sir? Where are you? There you are. Okay, next match. I just realized my YouTube channel is basically 50% what not to do and the other 50 is just shenanigans. Have you heard of potato candy? It's like one potato. Mixed with nuts. Half a potato mixed with a pound of powdered sugar. Sure. Sure. B-25 They're gonna read that and be like, what? Don't tell me Guys, you you guys over there It's a B-25 flying right over me and I can't do anything about it I'll Probably do something about that guy over there though There's a mosquito. Nope, I'm dead. Pilot sniped. Again. Okay then. Last. Well, depending on if I do well on this or not, this will be the last round for this video. Oh, we got a bomber taking off. Perfect. I can finally, finally, I get to eat. No, but in this case, it's finally, a, we can properly escort. I'm just gonna follow this guy. Or attempt to. to the 
<laughs> Come on. Let's go, boys. Oh, wow. Hang on. It's been a while since I've been playing on this side of the map. Usually I'm playing on the other side. Wait a minute. Wasn't one of the last games done on the uh, this map, but on the other side? Yeah, I do believe so. Good apple cider. Tetris. That just has those that type of song that is just like you want to rock out to without it being rock music. Anyway, speaking about Tetris, I think my favorite version of Tetris is on the original Game Boy. And if you don't know what a Game Boy is, look it up. They're a lot of fun. It's kind of like a... Well, the Game Boy is a pop... Uh, the handheld device from 89? I do believe was when the first one came out. And it was... It, if I remember correctly, the resolution is 8-bit, much like the uh, NES. If you don't know what the NES is, it's another old console. But anyway. The beautiful thing about the Game Boy is... Well... For its time, the battery life was pretty good. It was energy efficient, though it ran on four double A's. Then I do believe the next variant of the Game Boy to come out was the Game Boy Pocket. Basically the same thing, but much smaller. I actually have a Game Boy Pocket, and my dad has a Game Boy. The original Game Boys are called DMGs. They're DMG Game Boys. I don't know why they're called that, but they are. Anyway. <laughs> the KO-102 got his... Is just like... I'm gonna kill this guy! Now he's got the enemy airplane on his six. Hilarious. Well, he's dead. I'm gonna go after the... SU-2 now. Hopefully. Hopefully I can get him. I'm gonna have to do something about that. Hello. He's coming right at me. Oh, no. That means he's confident. Ah, I'm dead again! Ah! Man! That SU-2 is just killing. Holy crap! I was hoping to end the game off with a decent match that wasn't boring, but I was totally boring. Anyway, if you enjoy the content of this video, please leave a like and comment. If you enjoy the content of my channel, please, please hit the subscribe button and consider joining my Twitch and Discord. Both the links should be in the description below. And if you want to check out more videos, there may or may not be a card up here and this whatever the subscribe thingies anyway we'll see you in the next one bye